All right, I'm gonna try one more quick draft before class. Uh, let's see here. So this is. Uh, yeah, so that seems insane. That seems like there's no way that's not the pick. is in this pack we've got so the Wrangler is really cool Ghostforge, yeah I mean that's indisputable okay so yeah this is really cool I haven't got to play with that before that's just insane uh, removal good um Yeah. Yep, okay. So of these, um, Probably, I mean, let's see, like Mage Duel is one removal, but I don't want to go in this. I mean, obviously, I would want to take this because, like, this is crazy and I want to play this for sure. But, like, I do have to keep my options open even with a bomb like that. But, uh, I mean, this would be the other good one. But, yeah, I'll just go with, um, that. This is not terrible ability. It is a spirit too. But this is also a spirit. Yeah, right. Okay, so, uh, I don't think that's very good. Just the Pledge Mage. So either of these are good. Um, it's fixing more. I'm actually wondering, like, if having the fixing now is more important. This is more like, this is more desirable because this can, I'm, I'm imagining the bots like see this as either a red or a white card. So it's like less likely, this is less likely to get taken except if they're specifically in red white, whereas this could be taken by someone in red or in white. So yeah, I'm assuming the bots see that as more valuable. That's what I'm saying. So, uh... Yeah, I'll take it. Da, da, da. Um, this is a spirit, but I don't really care. I mean, usually trying to work towards spirit uh, synergy is not really worth it because it's just too slow. But this is such a bomb card that it might be worth it in this case if I get more spirit synergy to actually go for it. So I mean, this is the kind of enabler you need to actually make it work. Even if you have everything else, it just won't work. So this is pretty good. I want some cheaper stuff. It's also defend the campus. So it's like this versus defend the campus. 
Um, so there's that, and there's also the anatomy, which is great. I mean, this is the most, like, definitely red-white. I actually think I'll take this. Hmm, I'm not sure. Hold on. This is crazy on a flyer. Uh... Yeah, I'm actually going to take this early, because it's going to be like... It's, gonna, it's hard to get these, because just anyone will take them. I'm going to take this. I don't know if it's right. I definitely want to hope I get some good learn cards, otherwise it's just pointless. But, um... Damn. Um, this kind of sucks. So... This is not terrible. Even if you don't have a lot of stuff for Magecraft, it's at least a solid two drop blocker. Uh, actually pretty highly ranked. Um, is this a better trick than this? I mean, this seems like a better... Target creature blocks this turn if able. Uh... I mean, if I guess you can, like, you can, um... I'm trying to think. You could actually use this like early on just to get, just to get, like if you're desperate to get the anatomy, you could just waste this into turn. Um, I haven't played with this yet. I'm actually going to try it, just because I haven't tried it before. Um, okay. Familiar. Whenever one or more cards are put into exile during your turn, when this leaves the battlefield, whenever it dies, exile it. Whenever one or more cards are put into exile. Okay, so this um, this has the potential to be good, specifically with this. Um, But, I mean, there are other enablers for it. Like that lone, Lorehold Excavation or whatever. And, and also the Tome, the Tome, whatever, the doggy. So, uh, I already, I don't really want multiples of this because, like, you only have so many learn cards. And that's whatever. I'm gonna try it out. What is this? Discard a card. Uh, that's kind of crazy. Isn't it? Or maybe. I mean, it, should I just knock my Nintendo over? Hold on. Oh no. Hold on, I forgot to take my drugs. Alright, so, um, this is interesting. Obviously, I'm not going to play the blue side, but, um, draw a card, discard, oh, discard a card, then draw a card. So you need to, 
it's actually worse the other way around because you need to have you need to have an instant or sorcery already in your hand you can't draw into one so this could be good or it could do absolutely nothing and just sort of be I'm kind of not sure how to rank that exactly, but it's probably better than, well, I don't know, having, this seems, this seems really good. I didn't have very good success with it before, but it just seems insane. Potentially insane. Um, like... Red, black. Do I take this? Equal to its converted mana cost. Uh, the thing is, like, I don't want to, like, be playing a bunch of, like, instants and sorceries that are like bad enough to pitch to this like all the ones I'm going to be drafting are going to be like really good cards that I don't want to get rid of and like maybe I want to convert them into like a two or three point burn spell but um most of the time not most of the time I actually want to play them for what they are so I'm actually not going to take that uh now this card I don't really see how this is good. Other than I guess it just ramps you, but if you're at four mana already, like how high is your curve that you actually need that much more mana? And it gets bigger, but it's only got like two toughness, so like it just dies everything. So yeah, that's just whatever. I actually think um, I'm gonna try the boots again. Uh, let's see. Environmental Sciences is really good. I've learned that. It's good. I haven't been playing it, but I know it's good. In fact, it's even main deckable. But for now, okay, and then the other, the only other thing I can take is I'm slightly worried that Red White is drying up, but maybe I should just try to force it as much as I can. So I don't really like what else do I go into at this point? I don't know. I shouldn't worry too much. It's, it's pretty early. It's, it hasn't, I don't know if it's actually dried up. Or, oh, no. Uh, this looks bad. Um, I mean... If I had to switch into another archetype, I guess it would be blue-red. Because I've got this, that, 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 and these are all colorless. So it wouldn't be, I mean, yeah, it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world if I had to try to switch to blue-red at this point. At which case, I would probably uh, take this. I could even attempt three colors, but I don't know about that. Uh, okay, this sucks. Um, I really don't want to switch to blue-red right now. Well, I guess I could do... I could actually do blue-red splashing Ghost Forge. That actually wouldn't be terrible. Because I've got environmental sciences, and then maybe I can get like one more piece of fixing. I can pick up like a archway commons. Uh, what do I do here though? I guess I'll take this on the off chance I can still be in red white. Uh, Serpentine curse. Uh, 
I'm still going to hold out hope for red white. Okay, um. So let's defend the campus versus this. I don't really care about his ability, it's not super relevant. So it's really just him as a 4 3 4 drop. Um, I don't have very good bodies right now. In fact, yeah. I actually am. I only have two. That's bad. Okay, I need some more bodies. But, oh, come on. This sucks. Well. Blue, red, yeah, it looks like, yeah, it looks like maybe my blue, red, what is this? Wow. That's actually kind of insane. With, they all have flying, holy crap. Um, this is so good that I'm wondering if I switch gears and try to, I try to like, I try to splash this. It's all you need is one black and it just like, I have to try the, I have to try the splash this. It's like, there's no way I can't try to play this. This card is just wins the game by itself. Okay. So, I don't know what's going on with this deck. It's all... <laughs> I'm going to try to play it somehow. I have to try to play this. It's like... So what are my colors? Like... If I am blue-red, then this might be good. What does this do? You may exile from your hand and put three home counters on it. It gains at the beginning. So basically this gives... Uh, what's the word? Suspend everything. That's only if I have like, oh wow, I can actually, I just realized, I can, um, I can use this ability on Blot Out the Sky, and I'll be able to like, do four less on whatever my X cost is. Blue, red, at the beginning. The thing is, yeah, that, that ability isn't super useful. Because, like, it takes three turns to play it. Like, the, the discount isn't that great. Unless, like, you, you're running, like, really expensive spells. But then if you're running really expensive spells, you can't play them unless you have... See, I don't really care about that side, but then the red side, let's see what it says. Begin of your upkeep, exhale the top card of each opponent's library until end of turn you may cast Okay, that's really good. And whenever you cast a spell from exile And it gets bigger when you do it. So the red side of that is great. So I'll probably just use this just for the red side. Um Which is cool because it doesn't restrict me to blue. Since I'm sort of on the fence on what I'm doing. I mean. Yeah. Let's do it. So let's see here. So what am I? I don't want to play blue. So let's just not, not do that. Not do that. Okay, so my idea is red, white, splashing black. But I could also be white, black, splashing red. Since. Yeah. Mana tithe. This card's funny. So I'm low on creatures, aren't I? Or let's see, what am I on creatures? 
that's whatever. One, two, three. Oh, I see. Okay, so um, this is good with blot out the sky. Just like make a ton of flyers and then make more. I don't know. Let's kind of win more. This is just a good card regardless. Um, problem is like white. I kind of want white. I mean, I kind of want white to be my splash color. So I probably don't want to play a white run drop that isn't that good anyway. I might actually be like red black splash white. Or I don't know. I haven't seen actually no, there's not many black cards. So, um it's between like do I want a cheap flyer? This is good. Um, it's kind of between this and this. It's probably just got to be this. Okay. Uh, Combat Professor is good. It's got to be the best card here. I really need some more fix it. Like I, I would like if I had like a black. Or the like the 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 letter acceptance letter or whatever it's called. But um, this has got to be the best card. Let's see, Ardent Dust Speaker. So I had this, okay, it's just got to be the Heated Debate, I'm sure, is the best card here. I had this, but it's like, it was hard to do anything with it. Because I couldn't really attack in with it. Unless I gave it the boots, but I wasn't able to do that. So it's just got to be the Debate here. Yeah. What is this? Um... That is potentially a great ability, but I don't want to be blue, so... So it's got to be Letter of Acceptance. It's because it ramps and it lets me helps me splash the black. And it draws a card. Okay, yeah. Let's see here. Red-white is... Um, this is good because it has the synergy with the familiar and the Tome Shredder. And it also increased, it creates more spirits for this guy. So yeah, it sounds good. I just worry about, um, this is just got to be fast enough. Or it's, it's got to survive, you know, the um, fast aggro decks. So like... I could take this for fixing, additional fixing, or I could take this and just have removal. I only have one piece of, yeah, I better take this. Okay, um, I don't really care about that. This is actually probably better, having another learn card. There's not really anything I would... Yeah. Uh, shit. Another... <laughs> it sucks. Well, I definitely don't want that, so I guess I'm taking this. Uh, gee. They really want me to be in blue... Is it too late to switch to, like, pivot to blue-red? I don't know. Actually, wait. If I'm splashing black, this is another really good card. But it could also do nothing if I can't get black. 
It's like, how much do I want to screw up my mana base by splashing black? Uh, yeah, let's go for it. <laughs> That's wield. Um, interesting. So blue red is like really open. Okay, look at this. I have not got to play this. But, um,. I'm getting a lot of mythics. Mythic cards, aren't I? Uh, this is really good if you can get it down. It's either that or the Orator, and that might just be a better card, but uh, I don't know. I'm going to take that. <laughs> If only just to be a cheap rare drafter. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of... Okay, so if I was actually to switch, try to switch to blue-red, what would I do? I'd basically be cutting my white cards, which is not... These are, these are both so good, though. It's like... Shit. This is tough. This is a solid... Uh, that isn't that good. I would say it's between... It's between, like, these two. I'm still gonna f try to force Red White, because it's like, I just have two good cards, I'm gonna try to, like, make this work. Or I could take the commons, because I just need like as much fixing as possible. I mean, I also have the sciences for fixing. Which I could play main deck. Yeah, actually, I might actually play this main deck just to make sure, like... But I don't Let me see. Actually, if I have learned cards, then having this in my sideboard, like... Raises, is like a higher probability of me getting to play it versus having it in my main deck. So I guess I'll just keep it where it is. Um, I don't really want... I have a lot of, I've kind of bloated on 3 drops, so this might be better for... Uh, I'm actually going to take... Yeah, I'm going to take this. Because it's a pretty good ability, and it is just for curve consideration, because I don't have a 2 drop. Um, this would... Okay, so this... Oh, shit. Heated debate. I can't not take that, I don't think. That would help with fixing, though, but it's not... Yeah, okay. And then Divine Gambit is playable, I guess. Uh, this is a good ability on this. I can't block this turn. Um, I would like to get a Pillar Drop Warden, but I like that ability. I don't know. How useful is it? Because this is sort of be this. This is not meant to be aggro. This is sort of like long term, more long term. So like, <sighs> da, which is better? I actually think this is better. It's like a just a nice blocker too. Even though the... I don't know, like, the can't block this turn is, like, such... is potentially so good. I'm gonna take it. It might do nothing, but then it might, like... 
Uh, how? What am I on creatures? I'm super low on creatures. I almost wanted to grab this and try to splash, it. like try to splash it. But like, yeah. That isn't as good of a card to justify it. I could also rear direct it, but let's actually try to win. Let's see. Um, I guess another Tome Shredder. I'm just low on creatures. I need to grab a bunch of creatures now if I can. This always happens. I always end up low on creatures. So, um... This is good. Like I said, this is something I'm going to try to splash. But, like, in order to splash, I need shit. I'm actually going to take this. I don't know if I'm going to get another one. I think I just kind of need it. Oh, but then I got this. But then, let's see. So, how much fixing do I need? Exactly. Uh, shit. Three, four drops. How am I in four drops? Like, I already have one fuming effigy. I'm gonna take it. No. I don't know how how necessary is it that I have artifact removal. It doesn't come up super often, but I need more creatures probably. Uh, what does this do? That is kind of whatever. I'll take this. I don't know if I'll play it. It doesn't really do much. Um, so... Put target card from a graveyard. I mean... The goal is basically to play Blow Out the Sky. Or to get some flyers through. So. I don't need this. I could play this. I haven't got to play with this yet to see how it is. And I don't have like a ton of removal. I don't have a way to exile. Artifact creature. I'm going to try it. If only just because I've never gotten to play with it and I'd like to try it. And I don't think I'll play that. But, uh, so I'll take the uncommon. Uh, so this deck probably sucks. But let's see here. So... 5, 7, and 10, 11, 12, okay. 10, 17. I can cut at least one land. I cut one swamp. I don't know. How many, uh... 14, 16. These are... I don't know whether it's right to think of these as lands or not. I mean, definitely I can cut one. Uh, at least one land. I don't know if I cut another land. So, how many learn cards do I need? I think this is better learn card. Um, I don't care about that. I don't care about that. I definitely don't need that many studies. How greedy is it? Wait, 
do I have double white or double red? Oh shit. Let's see. Which do I need early better? I mean, I have double white for Divine Gambit. But I have a bunch of like... This is probably super greedy. I'm just gonna like play with fire here. And go a little bit on light on land count. Oh, I have double red for this though. Shit. Okay, so this is, I forgot, this is basically a 5 drop. And by basically, I mean it literally is a 5 drop. So what are my learn cards? I have that, that, that. I don't need to cut five more, like. Wait, five, six, seven. Let me cut four more. This doesn't. I don't know. What's okay? What's what's everything that pumps this up? I've got uh, that, but it's slow. Won't take any time soon. There's that, which makes that bigger. There's uh that. So I don't really care about that. It's not useful, but then I worry about my creature count getting too low. Like fourteen is getting pretty low. Um is it better than the shaman? I don't care about the I think the shaman I actually think I prefer that over the shaman. And then, like, uh... Okay, I don't need two defense. Define... Do I want... Okay, what's on my removal? Let's see. So this, this, and this, I think I had better remove at least... Get rid of at least one of them, like... Put a plus one, plus one counter. Um, what are my learn cards? I have pretty good, I have pretty good lessons. So, um, learn, learn, learn. How good is this? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think of like actual situations where I'd be using this. And uh, why am I drawing a blank? Yeah, this could kind of bum. Well, I don't know. You have to have like it to swing in with something. This lets you trade, basically. Be better if I had a death toucher or something. Um, get three one. In fact, it's only plus one on the, on the, uh, then how good is actually that? Just a plus one, plus one counter? 
I'm actually gonna I'm gonna cut that. I don't know if it's a mistake. Oh, I don't know though. Ah This might be hmm. I want stuff it seems like too I want I want early stuff that helps me survive. Like this doesn't I feel like this doesn't do a whole lot. I don't know, I was thinking like what does this do early on? Like it trades with something, but I don't have anything good to trade with. Yeah, it doesn't really do anything early. I kind of need to try to survive early. This does more. This has a higher chance of, like, as a useful combat trick. I don't know. Could be a mistake. That's why I need, like, the heated debates. I need to kill stuff. I need that. I need um, 7, 8, 9, 14. Of course, I could cut one of these letters, but I need the fixing. But, like, if I cut one more land and have the two letters, like, is that too greedy? Like,. Islands! Why are there islands in this? Stupid game. I just noticed that. Of course I don't need islands. God. Lucky I caught that. Man. Oh, okay, uh, so... This is seven. This is seventeen. Counting this, which I don't know is right to do, because fifteen is pretty low. Should be. Mm. But then I. Oh, but then I can. I can get. I can get. Like I can do guiding voice into environmental sciences, or study. Actually, this is useful. You know what? This is useful even if I don't. I should play this because even if I don't need it for its actual ability. It's a way for me to draw into environmental sciences, like on turn two. I could just pl I could play it on their creature, get environmental sciences, and that just like that helps me fix. So if I do that, if I have the two one mana, I feel better. And then I could either cut the gambit or the study, but I want at least, I want another learn spell because then I can like, eventually, I can play something else other than exhibition. I can play, I don't really care that much about that, but then I can I can get the exhibition. So, I think I will, hmm. I think I'll cut the gambit. Yeah. Okay, let's try that. I don't know what is going to happen here. Uh, well, this is good if I draw another land. So we got the letter, and I can play the spec. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Let's not get screwed here. Uh, okay. I don't like seeing red. Oh, wow, they're playing Mirage Mountains. Except it's not Mirage, because it's like New Border. Whatever. I have a feeling I'm about to get trampled and killed. They didn't have a play? Uh... Boy, I sure do hope I draw a land. Uh, 
I put no lands in my deck and I'm upset that I'm not drawing lands. How could this have happened? Uh, damn. God damn it. I probably should have held up the white so I could have bluffed the uh, the guiding voice. I just realized you could use this on your own creature to give it reach if you wanted to. Is it, is it nice, dude? Um, okay, what do I do here? So, I could play this, use its ability, it'll get, this, this and that will get bigger. Um, yeah, yeah, that's probably better. So I could kill this if I, I mean, I could double, well, I don't know. I could block it, then like, all he needs is like another guiding voice or something. So I'll just let it go. What is this? Whenever... Ah, oh, Christ. Wait. Oh, during your turn! Shit! care too much about this anymore.
Yeah, I should have done it last turn on my turn since I knew I wasn't going to block anyway. some way to pump this I'm sure if he doesn't way to pump it at least it'll trade I mean if he has like a 1-1 one -one or something I don't know it could be something worse doing where is it yep uh that doesn't oh wait that does kill me <laughs> so there's no point in uh yep if that had been the trample thing that would have been even worse So, that is pretty good. Um, well, I don't know. Um, that I guess. So let's see here. So I play this. The attack. Um, I mean, it's kind of dependent on what they have in their hand. I guess I play this for now. I mean, I could. I could hold this up just to kill that, but then they get. Either I have to sacrifice that to that, or yeah, let's just play this. Boy, that dwarf would have been really helpful here. Yes, they have like defend the campus and I'm just dead so if they have it is there even any point in going on I mean if they have it I'm dead I could block but then I'm going okay I'm going to assume that they have a pump cell but not specifically defend the camp I don't know. Screw it. Give it to me. 
Yep. They have it. Oh, no, they have that. Okay, I would have just lost no matter what. Okay. Is there any way I can make my deck suck less? I should probably add another land. This might be, you know what, actually, I think I'm going to play this just because it's a really good way to bluff. Because, like, you can bluff having some pump spell and, like, they'll not attack or whatever. Or they'll try to play around it. Then maybe I'll play one of these. Um... Instead of an acceptance, and then I'll play like. How useful is this? Because, like, this is more useful if you're trying to, like, ramp into something huge. But, uh. I need at least one. So I'm gonna cut something for another land, probably. maybe since I added wait I added two of those oh wait let me think here yeah I'm gonna get rid of that it just doesn't do anything 11 yeah seems better Players with Mythic Orange names are MTG Arena team members. Thank you for letting me know. I'll be sure to be extra toxic to them. Wow, it's THE Lucifer. Uh, okay. I actually have stuff I can play. Not very good stuff. I can just like absolutely destroy all their crap. Uh, neat. got some kind of trick here obviously uh, I will not block I'm 
wondering what specifically they have. They could have Lash of Malice. They could have, uh, this is warning. So I was, I was looking at their, uh, just looking at all the possible. So since I know they have some kind of I'm just going to swing in with both and I am going to, yeah, I'm going to learn because I want to grab something here, which will either be, um, I could get the sciences just to make sure that I get another land for them. Uh, or I could get, I mean, if I just grab, if I grab this, I can, I'll have a three toughness flyer. Shit. Between these, whether or not I would rather. I think this ability is so great on this that I would rather just try to guarantee I get it down as soon as possible. Although they could have removed and I'll just die instantly. So it's interesting they only attacked with this but not that, which makes me think. It makes me think they must have something like Lash of Mouse because, like, if they had some kind of pump, interesting pump spell, it wouldn't matter if I double blocked. But if I had this, if I had two, two, or indestructible, or indes so I'm thinking they don't have Professor's Warning. They could have uh, Lash of Malice. Lash of Malice, or, uh, wait, oh, they did have it? Ooh, I got it. Okay, so, um, so I think I would... Story target artifact or enchantment. Okay, so um, could they have another pump spell? Because I'm willing to double block and lose my spirit to kill this thing. Or they might not attack if they don't have another pump spell. They could have a kill spell. I don't know. What kind of kill spell could they have for this? I think they don't. I don't need to war. Okay, they're attacking with that. Uh, if they're attacking with that, then they must have some way. Or they just could be really great bluffers here. I mean, I can just, I can just like destroy this with my heated debate anyway. If they don't have anything good to play from whatever I exile, then I can just do heated debate and sciences. So specifically, um, spells. Okay, so not just for I, when I first read that, I thought just instants and sorceries, but that's just any spell, anything but a land. Okay, cool. What is this? Discard a card, create a pest. Each opponent mills cards equal to the life you gain this turn. 
exile four cards. Okay, that's not super scary. Oh, wow. But I can't play it. Oh, no. Oh, that would have been so good, but I'm glad they didn't get it. Oh, man. I can't play that. Um, so... Uh Should I just swing in with everything? Let me just I'll kill that while I can. Well, they're tapped. I don't know. I mean, I don't know what. Yeah, let's go for it. What can they have? Yeah, sounds good. Sounds great. You're real. Wow, really? You're just going to sacrifice your whole board? Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna like wipe my board, are they? Okay. And then they can mill, they can mill cards from me. Two cards. Uh, that's pretty good. I'm liking this dude. Uh, so I'm, I mean, I'm assuming he has some kind of pump spell. So I'll just, I'll take it easy. Getting emails. I have to, t okay. Got it, got it. All right. Ah, that sucks. Wait, they don't have blue. How are you going to play out without a blue mana, dude? Oh, they, they, they got that. Oh, I see. They got that just to discard it. Give me something good. Oh, just... No, nah, darn, darn. Okay. Um, here, I can... I can actually just swing in and then just kill what it like if they have a pump I'm assuming they have a pump spell so I can I can just swing in with everything and then whatever whatever they try to play a pump spell on I'll kill in response and then this will get massive uh, how obvious do I want to be with this? Let's just, yeah, let's just go for it. I'll hold this back because I want to make it big. If for whatever reason they don't have a pump spell, then I can just drop this. Oh, I guess I could have, um, I could have used this too. Uh... How about you don't do that? He should have played that after he blocked so that I wouldn't get damage. But... Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm guessing that was his only... Okay. That I guess that was the pump spell that I knew he had in his hand. Cool. Alright. Uh, looking good for me. Okay. I kind of super don't care. Uh, okay. That's a good question. What do I sacrifice? Uh, this can make... That ability will let me win the game. Like, So it's either this or this, probably. Uh, prob mm. it gives me lifelink, though. I'm going to sacrifice this. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. drew this dude so cool I just hope I don't get completely overrun before okay playing green so they're not playing like red white aggro so they might be a little slower uh, no Can I draw something to... No! Ah, cry mini. Look at this thing. Um... <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I may just take... If he wants to attack with this, I might... Yeah. If they want to attack with this, I might just... I'm assuming they're going to play a, a pest here or whatever. Or they don't? Oh. If they actually want to swing in with this... I might just let them, yeah. Um, I'm going to let them do that because next turn I can get the Ghost Torch down. And then I can just block with it and get it back. Uh... Except if they have a kill spell for him, then I'm just screwed. 
but I'm gonna go for it anyway. So, hmm. So I could play. I could play another spirit block. I could play another spirit block, put a guiding voice on the one that survives to learn. And that protects me from them having a kill spell. Uh, I don't know. Is that right? Is that the right thing? To... I know it's my go. Christ. <sighs> Except they're just gonna have. They're, they're gonna sacrifice something completely inconsequential. Um, I'm gonna try this. I don't know if it's the right decision. I'm just, I mean, I'm, I just should assume they do not have a kill spell. I don't know. This trades for, what do I have in my... If I, if I get a, um, huh. If I get a mascot exhibition... They just have a if they have a trample spell. No, okay. I was about to say I could play mascot exhibition. Or I could get it. I could get it for my sideboard. And then I could potentially play that the next turn. Each player looks at the top five cards of their library and may reveal a land or an instant or sorcery card from among them. Um, okay. I haven't seen this card. What did they get? They got mage. Ew. Oh no. That's bad. I didn't do okay so I actually meant to play the oh it's a sorcery shit I was like why did it, why did the game went I was like why did the why did the game skip over me so yeah I have to to jump block with this it sucks Dude. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this. Do they just have... Oh, no! I see what happens here. Ah. Oh. Man. I'm gonna have the same record as last time, where I have one win. 
time is it? I might lose in time for class to start. So that's convenient. Ah. So. I'll keep it. I really hope I get to actually play this. So I can either play the Shaman or I can play this and equip it, which is probably better because I don't really care about this. Yeah, let's try to draw into another land. Yep, uh, like I said, I really don't care about that. like to draw into black. Damn, now I can't, I can't attack in. Do I want to bluff? Do I want to bluff here? I'm actually wondering. How greedy would it be for me to swing in here and bluff? It's not worth it, because they, they don't want me to use the loot ability, so they, they might hold this back as an attacker. So, I should just play this. It's not worth it. I don't need to loot that bad. I mean, it would be nice to have a black, to get black for this, but I can drop this and this will, this will just be crazy. Assuming it just doesn't die instantly. I mean, if they have a, okay. I'm really glad that I baited their kill spell with that. Now I can try to draw into black. Nope. Uh, Alright. Please do not have another kill spell. Please do not have... No. Oh. Man. Ah, dude. Oh wait, I could have played him. Well, I guess he's a chump. I don't really know why I would want a chump blocker, but whenever a permanent entering ability, yabba dabba dabba do. Okay. I really need some black mana right now. Ah! 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 survive this turn I did notice they were tapped normally that's not a problem but it kind of sucks here so I will have to jump all of these
uh, at least I can create a hmm block 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 uh block 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 I think I just die because I don't have enough blockers um oh darn it you know if that had given me one health one life then I could have survived this turn. Hopefully they don't notice they have lethal here. Yep. Okay, that sucks. So it's a real shame that whenever I draw or whenever I draft some crazy mythics, like I never get to play them. Like, either of these would just be game winning. Okay, I did. Okay, that's not entirely true because I did get to play this and it did totally win me that one game. So, I can't feel too bad about that. But I did not get to take advantage of either of these, and that's depressing. So. What did I learn? Um, nothing. I learned nothing. I learned absolutely nothing. Tragic. <laughs>